Marvel's Avengers is ending development by next week, according to an article that was posted earlier today titled Marvel's Avengers has disassembled, posted on xputer.com and written by Miller. The link to it will be in the description below. From the article itself, according to sources at Crystal Dynamics, the announcement that Avengers is ceasing development could come as early as next week. Their exit strategy includes a series of changes to games' various systems, namely a removal of artificial time gating and an overhaul to the available cosmetic microtransactions. The game will remain available for sale digitally until at least September. Efforts are being made to keep the game playable for existing owners as long as possible. Outside of these changes and any subsequent bug fixes, the final regularly scheduled update is an upgrade to player traversal. As far as the unreleased content, Marvel's Avengers has had a wealth of content in various stages of development that will ultimately not see release. These include the patrol mode, a free roaming mode in the game's largest map that would see players accepting boss bounties, challenge the title's antagonists in unique encounters, among other small objectives. This update would also come alongside a join-in-progress functionality allowing players to drop in and out of fire teams without interrupting gameplay. From my own perspective, it's not looking too great, and to be honest, the writing was on the wall for this one. I don't really enjoy covering negative stories like this, but I've had a lot of tough love with the Avengers game. On the initial release of Marvel's Avengers, I had a great time playing through it. It had a ton of performance issues on PC and my entire playthrough ended up being about 20 to 30 FPS which was absolutely atrocious for such a big franchise. I honestly still can't believe that this franchise it's one of the absolute largest in the world and they still did not have content ready to go months or every other month when the game released and it's still one of the biggest letdowns for me. My only hope for this overall in the story of Marvel's Avengers is that, is that the other developers out there kind of learn from the mistakes of Crystal Dynamics and mostly Square Enix. I am pretty happy though that we do have games like Marvel Sons. We also have Guardians of the Galaxy, which are both fantastic games set in the Marvel Universe and doing their own things for the genre. So we at least have those. But let me know if you're still playing Avengers or not. Have you stopped playing it like me? Last time I really played was back when the Black Panther expansion came out and i had a good time with it but i fell off pretty quick like i have done before that's pretty much it for this video though stop by the live stream sometime thank you for watching and hopefully i will see you all in the next one